Starting tomorrow, get ready to discover the hero inside you when Disney on Ice skates into the BBC. And here to get us particularly excited are skaters Sarah and Sari. Ladies, thank you so, so much for being here. And huge congratulations to you because you are both extremely talented. I'm actually told this is a family business of sorts for the both of you. Sarah, your parents were figure skaters. Sarah, your mother actually skated with Disney on Ice. Yes. What does this life look like for you both, you know, as professional performers, athletes? I mean, that's got to present some exciting times and maybe some challenges, I'm sure, too, as well. Yeah, it's it's a really interesting job to have and this is my eighth year doing it. Wow. And so I obviously love it and I'm biased, but my whole family actually has been a part of Disney on Ice as well. Wow. And it's a really special thing we can all share and we love doing it. So amazing. Again, Sarah, your mother actually performed with Disney on Ice too. How is this yes. kind of now a full circle moment for you? Yes, I, it's very fun. Now we get to talk about all of our similar experiences from being yeah. on the road and um, living on tour. Um, we're in a different city every week, so the travel is exciting, the job is exciting. Amazing. Um, it's mm -hmm. just a great experience. I feel like this is the profession to be as an ice skater, right? I mean, there's, yes. there's so many different mm -hmm. avenues you could take, but to be with Disney on Ice, so exciting. And we don't want to disclose too much of the magic, but we're getting little preview of it here you guys play actually a number of different characters I'm told on the rink tell me what fans can expect to see at this show it is fun we've got costumes there's music how much fun for you guys is this and again what characters do you both play I portray the role of Ariel from The Little Mermaid. Amazing! Yes. Love that for you. Yes. That's so fun. And I portray the role of Belle from Beauty and the oh, Beast. Oh, fabulous. Two of my <laughs> favorite princesses. We got Mickey and Minnie out there. Because yes. again, two ladies, I mean, this is really, it's so amazing to think that this is almost like, I vouch to say, almost like a Broadway theater type production, but it's on ice. So you guys are singing, performing, dancing, and skating at the same time. Again, what yeah. are those moments like? I get you, you got little kids, I'm sure, kind of all freaked out in the stands. Just how exciting of a show is this for families who want to come out? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have six incredible stories. We have classics like The Little Mermaid and Beauty, Beauty and the Beast. And then we have some newer stories like Encanto and Moana. And so it's a great show to kind of bridge the gap between people who have been watching Disney on Ice when they were kids and now they can bring their own kids and create that family tradition. So sweet. And it's really, really exciting. We I hope you guys that. can all come. So adults are there too. What if adults don't have kids? Is, do you think oh, we can still come oh, there? Of course. Yeah. Or is that weird? Should I like no, of you course. Know, pretend and like play off like some kids? <laughs> my niece when it's not at all. I'm just there to see the show because it's going to be great. Um, I'm also curious too, ladies, because again, professional ice skaters, you guys are on the road during this time. Mm -hmm. I can only imagine, like, what does that look like for you guys training? I mean, you can't just like step off the bus and like practice, right? So what, what are kind of like some pre-performance? I think you guys both have some rituals or what, what does a day look like yeah. before you kind of step out onto the rink? Yeah, well, opening day, we get some ice time to practice, okay. um, which is always nice and kind of readjust in a new city and a different ice size yeah. um, and just kind of feel the ice and get back into it. It takes a minute, but sure. You we're play some there. pump up music, I'm told, to kind of yes. get ready, right? Sarah's That's usually my job. Of the, yep. of the pump up yeah. music. <laughs> and Sarah, you actually put, you say your left skate on first, yes. always? Yeah, I, yeah. It just, it's just, that's how it is. The way it simply to, must be done. Yes. And we're not going to question it because you're fabulous at what you do. Well, ladies, we cannot get enough of this show. Um, just again, for people watching, just one more time for us again how exciting this is for you all. Again, it's Disney, it's ice skating, it's all the magic wrapped up in one. Any kind of final words you can say on this great production? Uh, yeah, I would say that you guys should definitely come and see it because not only do we have skating, but we also have flying acrobatic routines as well. Wow. So yes. we have Ariel um, ascending 30 feet up into the air and she's doing a flying routine called the Spanish Web. We have a lot of dazzling special effects and transformations and Wow. My favorites, Mickey and Minnie. Yeah, and the theme I, I should say too, find your hero, which is also really sweet. Mm, what yes. do you kind of hope audience members take away with that? We hope that everyone gets to find their inner hero. And we love, too, the kids are always excited singing along, coming in whatever outfits, costumes, yes. characters. Yes, kids and grown-ups yes. singing kids along, and, and they may or may not be in costume. I do have a Belle costume. Okay. Fun I'll fact, I'm sometimes <laughs> Belle at kids' birthday parties on the side. You can email me if you're interested in that. <laughs> Ladies, thank you so, so much. Again, Disney on Ice skating its way to the BBC this weekend, April 18th to the 21st. Uh, we'll have the link to get tickets on our website, tvliving.com. But for now, Sarah and Sari, thank you again so, so much. Thank Welcome you. to Rocket City and have fun this weekend. We're so blessed to have you. Thanks.